Today I will show how to draw the European CE logo. This is the official version, but in this picture you get a clearer view. You can add a sketch on any part surface, or create a fresh standalone sketch if you want to create a block. For size control later on, we add the variable x with value 1 as base for all dimensions. Start your sketch and draw two circles from the same center point. The outer circle gets the dimension of x times 20. So, equal sign, select the variable and type star 20. The inner circle gets x times 14. Next, we add two line segments coincident with the two circles. Add a collinear relation between the two and an additional vertical relation. As dimension between the circle center and the segments, use value x. Select trim entities and trim to closest. Here, I'll leave the cutout parts as construction lines for visual reference. Go to Linear Sketch Pattern, activate Dimension X Spacing, deactivate Instance Count, and finally select the entities. Now, you can change the dimension SolidWorks added. Here, you fill in X times 17. Next, you construct the dash. Add three line segments with horizontal and vertical relations. Add one construction line from the center to the middle point of the line. Make it horizontal. Use X as dimension between the dash and the circle center. Use x times 3 for the width of the dash. Finish the sketch by trimming the inside circle. Extrude or cut as desired. By changing the value x, you can now accurately control the size or link it to other dimensions. For frequent use, it makes more sense to save this as a block sketch. To do this, open the sketch again and select Make Block. Select the two symbols. Selection is possible with a single click when Shaded Sketch Contours is on. Activate the Insertion Point menu. Drag the handle to the desired position and hit OK. As last item, select the block and press Save Block. Name it and save it to the desired location. To use the block, I have an example cube. Start a sketch on the desired face. I'll add one construction line. To position the block, proceed to Insert Block, browse to the block location and select. Position the block with the insertion point. Dimension when needed and exit. To control the size, edit the block sketch, 
select the block. In the block menu, you can now control the size and the rotation. Lock angle to fully define your sketch.